another mostly true story. I'm really not cut out to be a cowboy Never did learn how to rope and ride Or roll them, roll them, roll them Even get them going Really wasn't meant to be a cowboy Well, my daughter, she married a farmer Here a few years ago I realized there was a lot about agriculture I didn't know. On the radio, all I hear is about these things called heifers and steers, and I never really did know what they were talking about. So one day out on the farm, I got a ride along. Right away, I got the drift. As they checked the new ones here, they put a yellow tag in one ear. But the heifers have it in their right ear. Steers is in their left. I'm really not cut out to be a cowboy. Never was cut out to rope and ride. Roll them, roll them, roll them. Even get them going. Never was cut out to be a cowboy. Well, I shared my findings with some of the other guys as we was riding back. And they all looked at each other kind of funny. So one of the guys, he says to me, maybe you should come and see just what goes on when we're working cattle. Well, that was something new. I mean, what kind of a work can a cow do and why does it need so much supervision? So I bought rubber boots, like they said, and I walked out to the shed where the cows were already standing in a row. Well, I found out right away what I'd learned the other day about steers and heifers. It really wasn't so. The little girls each got some shots. The little boys, they reached a spot where in a few short seconds, their lives were changed forever. I learned right away which end of that cow not to stand and I'll never wear those rubber boots again. Yeah, I'm really not cut out to be a cowboy. Take my cow wrapped up in cellophane, thank you very much. Since I don't know what to do, yo lady who, yeah, really wasn't meant to be a cowboy. Yeah, really wasn't meant to be a cowboy.